Who would have thought after only 33 days they were gonna come out of the waters? And by they, I mean the trolls. When I started creating these one minute content videos, it was just meant for Instagram and Facebook. And the reason why I steered away from YouTube is because I tried it in the past for about six months. I was on and off and I wanted to try something new. The thing is, I got advice from a friend and they said, hey, you might as well start posting on YouTube again because the hard work is already done with filming, editing. So I'm like, cool, you know what? Might as well. Started doing it. And for those that don't know, the one thing that YouTube is known for is its comments section. Personally, I'm not a big fan of mainstream comedians or comedy movies, but the comment section on YouTube never seems to disappoint. And sometimes they can be straight ruthless. And that's what I saw yesterday. And I've seen firsthand the comment section just belittle a YouTuber. And it gets bad to the point where the content creator disables their comments, not responding to any of their fans, and on a rare occasion, choosing not to upload. And from what I've seen and what I've been advised, there's two approaches that I'm going to stick with. Ignore or troll back.